A rumble in the night. Thousands shaken awake around three o'clock this morning to homes rattling from an earthquake. Everything is vibrating. That's a big one. The 7.6 magnitude quake struck in the Banda Sea and was felt across Australia's far north. We have received over 2,600 community felt reports ranging from Kununurra, Darwin, obviously, Tennant Creek, Norrmboy and even some of the um, very northern parts of Queensland. So far, there's been no reports of significant damage, bar plenty of broken sleep. It was definitely an early morning, got a bit of a fright when I woke up. Woke up, grabbed a dog, went downstairs and listened to everything shake. <laughs> Car alarms going off, dogs going off. Very significant earthquake, yes, very significant. So uh, uh, next time I'll make sure my, my wardrobe door is closed and doesn't rattle so much. <laughs> The quake also saw emergency phone lines light up with around 300 calls. These travellers had just arrived in Darwin when their high-rise hotel began to rumble. It was crazy. It was we were shaking back and forth. There was there was a lot of movement in the building. It was it was a bit worrying. The pair had previously lived through Newcastle's 1989 earthquake in which 13 people died. This one seen more shake than the ground go up and down. While there's been no reports of damage in Australia, local authorities in Indonesia's Tanenbar Islands say 15 houses and two school buildings were damaged, with one resident suffering injuries. Matt Garrick, ABC News, Darwin.